at six. And there will be people falling for him. And if I could just save someone from doing that. A Fargo man is warning people to be on the lookout for what he says is a scam in the local paper. A classified ad for an ATV in the Fargo Forum has one man blowing the whistle and concerned that others in the valley will lose their money. The ad is for a 1998 John Deere Gator. The person selling it is asking for $1,500. But it's once you start trying to purchase the item where things get sketchy. Valley News Team's Ashley Bishop talked with the man who says multiple red flags went up and others should be aware when looking to buy items from the paper. Doug McDougall says... He looks through the forum classified ads often. He's been looking for an ATV to use for hunting and fishing. He thought he found a great deal on a 1998 John Deere Gator. It was it's very good. I mean, this is a a five or six thousand dollar machine for fifteen hundred bucks. Doug called the number, but the seller would not answer and only wanted to email. In the emails, the seller said he needs a decision as soon as possible. He would accept payment first, then mail the ATV from Utah later. The more we got into it, the more there was more red flags. The seller wanted Doug to pay him via Google Wallet. Doug was told that Google Wallet would hold the money until he received the ATV. Doug decided to verify that fact. It was in big capital letters, we do not hold money for someone. So there... That was when I said, no, that is not going to happen. Doug says he and his girlfriend tried to contact the forum to alert them about the scam on Wednesday. But since then, the ad has appeared two more times, and they have not heard back from the newspaper. I buy things out of the paper all the time, but, but you know, like, you think they're legitimate, but this one is not. A spokesperson with the BBB says this sounds very similar to the automobile scam that happens on Craigslist and warns people to be careful with the new payment technology like Google Wallet. Make sure you understand it before using it. Doug just wants people to remember the golden saying. If it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. In Fargo, Ashley Bishop, Valley News Live. We reached down to the Fargo Forum to find out if they were aware of the suspicious ad and if so, what they plan to do about it. We haven't heard from them yet. This story came to us from our whistleblower hotline. You can call 701-237-6576 or submit your tip on our website, valleynewslive.com. Just click on the whistleblower hotline button on the right.